Hey, it's Mark with Botanical Crosswords. Let's get started. In case you guys are interested, go to crosswordlabs.com and simply search for floral inflorescences for this particular crossword. The first answer is spathe. It's a type of bract that forms a sheet to enclose a flower cluster, often describing arums and palms. A good example is the native jack in the pulpit plant, Erisema triphylla, which is found in the next picture. Indeterminate is the next answer, a type of inflorescence which is not terminated by a single flower in which the primary axis or stem continues to develop as the lower flowers open. Ragweed is a common example. Spadix is the next answer, a type of inflorescence that has many small flowers born on a fleshy stem, common in many, many arums, such as this picture of Peltandra, another native. Spike is the next answer, a race most and hence an indeterminate inflorescence that bears unstocked flowers along a common axis or stem. Corum is the next answer, a type of inflorescence that outer pedicels are no longer than inner ones, unlike umbels that originate from a common point. Tepal is the next answer, a single segment of the perianth that cannot be distinguished or differentiated, such as our Florida native Zephyranthes. Sepal, the outer whorl of a perianth of a flower, usually small and green, but sometimes colored and petal-like. Sepals are part of the flower structure, racks or not. Racine, an indeterminate unbranched inflorescence with many unstock, many stock flowers born on an elongated axis. Catkin, a racemose flower spike with conspicuous bracts and small, often unisexual flowers lacking petals, as in this picture of an oak. Perianth is the next answer, the collective term for sepals and petals, particularly when they are very similar in form. It derives from surrounding the flower in Latin. Umbel is the next answer, a type of inflorescence that exhibits many pedicels originating from a common point that can be simple or compound, such as this picture of a carrot flower. Bract is the next answer, a modified, often protective leaf at the base of the flower or flower clusters. They are large or brightly colored or small. Bracts are not direct structures of the flower. Pedicel is the final answer, a floral stem that connects a single flower to the inflorescence, often used to describe umbels and derives from little foot in Latin. Thanks for participating and be on the lookout for another crossword in the future.